We will be doing an example number two, which is saying that it's a synchronous motor, it's a three phase start and synchronous motor. And it is a 1000 kVA, 11,000 11, volts machine. It has resistance RA and uh, X per phase as 3.5 and 40 ohms. This is also a per phase value. And apart from that, we have to determine the induced EMF and the angular retardation of the motor when fully loaded at unity power factor and at 0.8 power factor lag. <clears throat> we have to find the angular retardation and induce EMI. When the power factor is unity and secondly 0.8 power factor lag, we can do the same problem for 0.8 lead also. <coughs> Since it's a three phase star connected load, star connected, sorry, synchronous motor with uh, 1000 kV and 11,000 11, volts, and uh, resistance and reactance R and X uh, per phase is given as 3.5 ohm and 40 ohms. So we have to determine the induced even per phase and angular retardation when it is fully loaded and on unity power factor 0.8 lag and at 0.8 lead. So, first of all, uh, as the in the example one which we have done, we have to find somewhat um, like that only, but it's a somewhat different question. <coughs> Here, I have to find first of all the current, full load current IP, which is which can I can get by this. This is 1000 kVA, so 1000 into kVA rating 1000 divided by 1100 <coughs> and root of 3 into 1100. So I can get this current IP as 52.5 ampere again. Now, so this is a VL, so we have to find VP, which is equals to 1100, sorry, 11,000 divided by 3, which is equals to 6,351. 6351. Again, uh, as a question in the previous question, I found in the armature drop, uh, armature evidence drop that was I into Z. So here also I am finding I into Z S, which is giving, which is the armature drop. Which is equals to my current 52.5 into Z 3.5 plus J 4.0. So by solving, because I need to have the magnitude of this, I have to do it. Uh, I have to multiply this um, as by 3.5 square into 40 square under root of that which we will be getting multiplied by 2.5. So I'll be getting answer as 2100 volts. I into Z. Again, I can find the beta again. 
beta is equals to tan inverse of <coughs> x by r that is minus 40 divided by 3.5 which is beta is equals to 85 degrees tan inverse of this which will be giving me the value 85 degrees so again i can send the theta is here i have to find the theta now theta is already given as uh, unity power factor cos phi theta is 1 so cos phi unity power factor is uh, right now theta is 0 so i can directly I'll do this for question for first of all unity power factor answer would be how this is looking actually uh, we have seen that vp and ep graph and i so this is our unity power factor so it will be in phase with e so the theta will be zero at that time so i will be getting directly cos 85 for unity power factor, E per phase will be again the same one, VP square plus of I into Z square plus of, sorry, minus of 2 into VP into I Z S into cos of 85 degrees, which will be giving me VP is my 6351 i into z drop is 2100 and this it will be giving me i can write this thing vp is my 6351 square plus of 2100 square minus of 2 into 6351 into iz is 2100 into cos of 85 degrees which will be giving me e per phase as 11280 11280 I will be getting E per phase as 11280 So how it will be looking actually <coughs> It will be looking like I can uh, remove this thing right now It will be looking somewhat like EP, which is 6351. EP is 6351. I have to remove this thing. This is 6351. This is equivalent to 6251. 6215, sorry. 6351, Sorry, this is six six. This is equal to six five one three, which is E B and I'm getting six three five one as V P and this is two one zero zero as I into Z drop. So, <coughs> again, in this, since theta is 0, it is in the phase with EP only, at that point, from this, I can have one more thing, delta is 85 degrees, delta is in between B and P, this is delta which I have to find right now, so, from this figure, I can clearly have this is from this figure I can triangle from this triangle I can directly have sine delta which is the angular retardation is equals to 
i into z drop this one i z x drop multiplied by sin of beta plus theta divided by my ep so please remember this formula for angular retardation so i into z drop we got as 2100 multiplied by sin beta plus theta sin beta plus theta theta is zero sin 85 directly so it will be sin 85 is almost uh, uh, 0.99 divided by EP is 6513 which I'll be getting as 0 0.3212 0 0.3212 so sine delta or the angular retardation for unity power factor for this machine when 11,000 volts is there is 0.3214. In the same way, I can do the second question. In the second part, in the second part, uh, we have found the, the VP, we have found everything. So it will be the figure would be like almost the same, only the beta and EP will be EP is will be finding EP and uh, VP is already given that is 6513. This is I, I into Z drop that is equals to 2100, it will be the same. And I have to find EP first of all. This is my delta, and since it is 0.8 lakh, so this will be theta. This will be theta. And this angle will be beta minus theta so I can find beta minus theta that theta is given as 0.8 lag that is equal to 36 point uh, 660 degrees almost so I can get beta minus theta is equal to beta is already given as 85 degrees minus of 36.66 degrees which is equal to 48.7 So we will remember this 48.7 Here 48.7 will come <coughs> So I can find the EP right now It would be under root of EP square Plus of I, IZ square Minus of 2 EP into IP into cos of uh, beta plus theta or beta minus theta since it is like beta minus theta right now. <coughs> so 6351 square which is VP plus I into Z is 2100 square minus of 2 into 6351 multiplied by 2100 multiplied by cos of beta minus theta that is 48.7 so by solving this I can get EP as 5190 uh, so I can write here 5190 so again from the same triangle I can find sine delta is equal to IZ S drop multiplied by I this sign of beta minus theta divided by pp that is 5190 so i can put the values 2100 multiplied by sine beta minus theta sine beta minus theta is uh, we have to find that is 0 0.7943 0 0.7943 divided by ep is 5190 i can get this as sine delta as 
or this is the answer for point eight like angular retardation, and this is the answer for p per phase for point eight like. So in the third part, point eight like, in the same way we can do the third part also. In the third part also, I'll be getting it's a point eight like. Now the, there is a slight change in this question in point eight like. Then this will be plus. So I'll be getting some angle here. This would be changed. So here, uh, in, when I'll be finding EP, then I'll be putting beta plus theta there, and uh, I'll be find, I'll be able to find E per phase. And from again from the formula sine delta is equals to uh, Iz drop multiplied by this thing divided by this thing will give me the sine delta, and uh, from that. I can find EP. EP would be coming as seven six seven zero, and I get sine delta after that as thirteen point two seven. This is of course the value of delta actually. I'll be getting delta as thirteen point two seven degrees.